Ramsey got something in the mail. Ooh, -wee. let's see what this is. All right, check it out. Elijah just updated his library card. Did all right, Danielson, do you want to explain what's going on here? All right, so we're just gonna do, it's a real simple, fun, um, fun little, I guess, prank. prank. All the kids are half asleep. 12.40? It's 12.40, it's almost 1 a.m. Oh, wow. oh my goodness. <laughs> so tomorrow we're gonna to be making a recipe from my mom. We're gonna be making a recipe from my mom. You guys, we're, we weren't able to do a cook with me with her, so we're gonna do a recipe that I grew up with her making, and it's gonna be the chicken mole. <laughs> yeah, yeah! So I'm gonna get a hold of her, ask her how she makes it, and I'm gonna cook it up for the family with maybe some Spanish rice or or uh, we'll see. We'll see something what else. Something delicious. Yeah, something else. Yeah. And so stay with, so stay with us. Um, for, for a cook with me. Hey Fam Bammers, what is up? Welcome to another vlog, you guys. Today has been kind of just a lazy day. It's actually three o'clock in the afternoon right now. We've kind, of just, we've kind of just been hanging out. The kids have been kind of playing. Um, Ethan's actually at a friend's house today. Brayden's off on his trip. He left at 4 a.m., you guys. He left at four in the morning. He's gonna be going and staying on a, on a yacht. That's his camping trip, so they live a rough life, you guys. Danny is gonna be making his mom's recipe today. He is going to be making some chicken mole. So we're super excited to do that, so you guys stay tuned for that. Um, we're gonna kinda do this vlog style, but the recipe will be coming at you soon. What are you guys doing? We're doing a Would You Rather video. Mm. Nice. So would you rather this? So what, this one was, would you rather have a beautiful house and an ugly car, or have an ugly house and a beautiful car? Oh. Comment down below what, what you would pick. Me what would you pick? Have a beautiful house and an ugly car. Same. Same, I agree with that. Mm -hmm. I but would say that. Look at that ugly house and that cool car. Ooh, those are good questions. Good house and ugly car. Nice. Cool, you guys, so what have you been doing today? Well, nothing. Just I hanging out. for like two hours. Yeah, he went to bed really late last night, So, and it wasn't two hours, it was like 30 minutes. Really? <laughs> yeah, it felt like two hours though, huh? No, but literally, I, I think I fell asleep at one and three right now. No. Like three, three, I think you were asleep for like 30 minutes, man. I was asleep bleeding. for an hour. Oh, maybe an hour. I'm bleeding. Oh my mama. Oh, nice, no. except you have a red popsicle in your hand. Well, it's not that. Look at guys, I'm licking blood. Frozen blood. Okay, that's gross. Hey doggies, what's up? What's up, Doggy? Oh, Benny. Oh, Benny. Oh, Jasper. It's kind of a windy day today, you guys. So some of this toilet paper is coming out of our tree. So I got to come out here and just pick some of this up, which I'm glad it's coming out from the tree because we cannot reach it without a ladder. There we go. There's still some up there, though. Check it out. Boom. Still got more to go. I think it will work its with the wind. All right, next would you rather question. Use would you eye drops made of vinegar or use toilet paper made from sandpaper? Oh, that's a hard one. What do you guys I, think? I would do this one because that's just going to hurt your eyes. Yeah. Oh, I'll do this one too. I agree. I would do the sandpaper. Totally agree. It, it would be uncomfortable when you wipe. But that, no, that's that would like sting so eye. bad. Yeah, no thanks. Yeah. I think I've used some toilet paper that's felt like sandpaper before anyway. I think I have too. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Asha Bash, what's up girl? Hi. Say hi to everyone. Oh, we got another popsicle going. Okay, what do you guys it. think of these old school popsicles? We love them because they're super cheap and they just like remind me of summer. Do you need help? Do you know how you do those? No. You do it on the edge of the... Uh, Countertop. Oh. I'll show you next time. Is green your favorite? Mm. You'll find out. Delicious? Nice. Hey, what's up, everybody? We're always going to be like, I think, facing this direction in our house because the lighting just it looks better on camera. So we're going to head out right now to Vaughn's to go pick up some quick little items for kind of like our first vlog style cook with me. Actually, our first cook with me was like vlog style, I think when I did the tuna melts. So we're just gonna go back to doing things like that, still give you guys your 
your, uh, fulfill your food cravings, and we're gonna do chicken mole. I think Tina might have mentioned that, but we're gonna do chicken mole, real easy peasy. It's as easy as the garden, the Olive Garden chicken, you guys. Which we love, you guys yes. know, we love easy peasy. Yeah, so we're gonna go do that right now, get that cooked up, take it over to Paul and Inez, and watch the Knights game. Yeah, baby, oh, I need yeah. some Knights gear, man. Serious, and I'm thinking, Shoot. man, for whatever reason, I was craving uh, fizz today. I know why. Why? Yeah. It had to have been the pregnancy simulator. Oh, he, <laughs> Okay, okay, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, yeah. It's messing oh. with your, it's messing with your stuff. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, last night, I had weird pain, pain, like no, pains didn't. in my body. Did you? Yeah, I was like, no. dude, this is either mess with my head, or I was like feeling weird last oh, night. Oh man! So man, I, everyone's comments today are so funny though. I'm like oh, laughing yeah. so hard. Tina had to say, "Suck it up, Buttercup." Yes. And she had to say, "Hashtag Big Baby." Whatever. <laughs> We're gonna do a challenge coming up, you guys, and two of those are gonna be on me, and two of those are gonna be on her. I can handle it, you're a big baby. <laughs> guys, go see him cry in that video. <laughs> Whatever. Versus a baby boy a ba or a baby girl, we choose both. Yes, I choose, I choose both, both too, yes. I like that you guys chose both. I mean, you chose, no, that's your small. Like on one it says, um, on one it says, say dad, say mommy, and I say both take both. Aw, oh, you guys, that's awesome. Thanks so much. Yeah. Aww. I love, don't they look so cute though? Would you rather save a baby boy or a baby? All right, guys, we got the game going on right now. We got Danny over there getting ready to cook some chicken mole. But look, check it out. It's one zip right now, guys. One zip. So I think we're going to make this chicken mole and then head on over to the Inez, how Inez rolls, right? Yeah, we're gonna go see Paul and Inez, and then, and then, yeah, watch the rest of the game. Awesome, let's do this. All right. All right, so we got the water boiling. This is a real simple, easy recipe, you guys, and you can make the mole, the Mexican sauce, like, from scratch, but my mom says, and that's what I remember, like, my mom's mole was so good. She's like, I just use it out of the can. I use yeah. the Doña Maria, and... And that's that. Well, so. you know what? When you have a family, and she had five kids too, like that's sometimes what you have to do is not everything is going to be homemade. So yeah. it's a so, good way to do it. We got the water boiling. She says we're going to put the chicken and in in the boiling water um, with one whole onion for one. flavoring. Awesome. And then whoo, we'll get that in, and then then we're going to get some chicken breasts in here. Once we're done with that, once that's all cooked up, we're gonna shred the chicken breast, and then we're gonna um, we're gonna start making the mole. Now, what you do is you take four parts of water, but my mom says use this uh, like chicken broth. Yeah, so save the that. Water. So yeah. Saving this, you use four parts of the chicken broth to one part mole, and then you mix it and bring it to a boil. And she says, Ooh. if it starts getting like real thin, just add some more mole. Yum. And so does this just, I've never had it. So is this just like over rice? Yeah, you put over white rice with the chicken and the mole. And honestly, oh. it's, so, it's so good. I'm excited because you've been talking about it for so yeah. long. I'm like, it's dude, I can't wait. It's got a different taste, but I don't know if it's, I don't know. It, I just, I've always loved it. And I loved it with rice. And it's just, it's as easy as your, um, Olive Garden chicken recipe. I think it has more steps than my Olive Garden chicken recipe. Oh yeah, you're but Garden, it's like it's literally pour it on the chicken and put it in the thing. Yeah. So Where this one is, you do have to boil it. You do have to cut an onion. You do have to follow the directions on the mole. But otherwise, yeah. easy. <laughs> easy peasy. And this is this is the mole that we're using, the Doña Maria. Doña Maria. Oh, Maria, Maria. <laughs> So, You're welcome. Yeah, there you go. You're welcome. And um, yeah, so this is really good. This is like the mole Mexican sauce. So what does the what are the directions on the back? Are you gonna walk us through it? Uh, yeah, I pretty much just explained it. Oh, so it just takes you just add water to that? 
You add the water to it, four parts to one. You bring it, you put it on low heat and you bring it to a boil. Ooh. Mix it up and around. My mom says if it gets, seems thin, then just add a little more of the mole to thicken it up. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. And cool. She said it will thicken, it's supposed to thicken up over some time, but. Sweet. Awesome. There you go. There Can't you go. wait. Dinner, dinner. Chicken dinner. Oh, yeah. Oh. All right, here's the chicken. Just gonna put it, I just got some chicken breasts. We're gonna put those in, boom, whoa. Whoa, Mama Sita. These are some nice, good sized chicken breasts. Mama Sita, Mama Sita. Oh, so I got three, which is I think plenty for the family. Yeah, those are pretty big breasts. Yeah, let me go ahead and wash my hands and we'll, <laughs> let me go ahead and wash my hands and we'll be back. Okay. The chicken is ready, it's cooked up. Smells got, good. Oh, yeah, the onions, that's a good touch right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna get the chicken out because I like it shredded. I think my mom would shred it. She might do it like um, big, like kind of bigger chunks shred, but I like it shredded. And I'm gonna get that, and take it on over to the KitchenAid, and quickly shred it up. And there's the broth. That's what you're gonna use for the mole, right? Yeah, and say, the mole instructions say to add water, but my mom says use the chicken broth. That probably um, gives it so much flavor. Yes, so that's what we're gonna do. Let's go ahead and get these bad boys in here. It's like tender, falling apart. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom chakalaka. And it says to basically put the chicken in um, the boiling water for about an hour, but it didn't take that long. Mm, maybe 30 minutes. Yeah, 30, 45 minutes. So let's put this bad boy on. Get a um, let me see here. Oh yeah, might want to plug it in. Might want to plug it in, you know what I mean? Gotta lock it down. Now it is. Now it is. Oh, look at that shred. I love this tool. That this. I've never used it to be honest. Oh, you haven't? Uh -uh, I always just use forks, but this is awesome. It's so easy. All right, so now I'm just gonna transfer the chicken, shredded chicken. I kind of left it a little chunky. Oh, chunky. We're gonna monkey. let it. Uh, we let the chicken simmer with the mole. When we get it going, you guys. Ooh -ee. I have not had this since probably like I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna say my my teens. Oh early, wow! My teens to early twenties. I'm That's curious if it will taste the same. Yeah, too. we'll have to see. This is how she does it. Yeah. So you know how like your taste buds change sometimes. All right. So I've got. Uh, one cup of the chicken broth and a quarter cup of the mole. So I'm gonna put it in here and it's on a low, low heat. Let me go ahead and get, I'm gonna go ahead and get the wooden chancla. Wooden chancla and then the mole, it's kind of crazy how that is. And we'll put more. Cause it's, and it, my mom says it will thicken up as it heats up. Oh, look at that. Ooh. And she says that if it starts thinning out, if it's too thin, I'll just add a little bit more of the mole. So you just cook it to the directions on the back of the mole. Yeah, it says basically um, you're gonna basically do this and you're gonna let it let it get to a boil. Yeah. Boom, check it out, totally thickening up. That's crazy. Tina put together some nice white rice. We've got our shredded chicken there. I actually put some salt on the chicken. I like having some salt on it, just kind of like in the chicken to kind of flavor it up. All right, so it's go it's starting to boil right now. I added a piece of onion in here. I just put a chicken in here, but it's starting to boil. What I did was I put two cups of the, um, of the chicken broth, and so that means I put because it's uh, four parts to one, two cups, I put um, half a cup of the, the mole. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna add the chicken and we're gonna let the chicken and the mole simmer together. Ooh. All righty. So, thankfully I have my beautiful wife here. Oh. And she's like, I think you should just add the mole to the chicken. So that's what we're gonna do. Just cause it's a bigger pan. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna add that in. Ooh, we're gonna let it all simmer together. Oh, that looks just like how. Does it? Yeah. Like how you remember? Right, right there, that oh. does, it's nice and dark. Oh yeah. I can already tell it's gonna be so flavorful. We'll see. Hopefully it's a flavor 
I don't know if it's like an acquired taste that it has to be or Maybe. what. Like any food. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and mix it with this. Oh yeah. Oh, mole mole. Crap. Oh, I just remember I totally getting like flashbacks where like the shredded chicken, like I used to like to chew on it, like and ball it up in my the side. Oh, of my okay, mouth. that's gross. What? That's <laughs> awesome. Like, is that crazy here? though? How food can like bring back memories? Yeah. Right. Just love it. But yes, this is so it. Oh, you did it, babe. Oh, I, hope, I don't know if it could taste like my mom's. Uh, I'm sure it's be pretty but close. We'll see. It's her recipe. You followed it, so I'm sure it's delicious. Oh Ooh man, look at that. That does look good. And that it's probably. It's probably a somewhat of a different flavor than what the kids will be used to. Yeah. It's just it's just different. Yeah. But it'll be good on rice. I'm curious as to what they're gonna what they're gonna say. Oh wow. Look at that, you guys. That looks good, honestly. And the smell, it's different. Yeah. Yeah, I mean it's not like this. It smells oh. good though. Oh, I like it. But I like the it's smell. Different. All right, Danny's gonna give it a try, but I just have to update Golden Knights. It's now three two. Three two, baby. Woo! By the time you guys are watching this, you're gonna know what the score was. <laughs> yeah, let's see, you guys. I haven't All right. Had this in years, I don't know if my taste buds. So, did you normally have this with white rice or Spanish rice? My mom said Spanish rice, but I remember it with white rice. Okay, so you could do either because or. I don't remember, like, when anytime you have like a, like a sauce or anything like that, it's usually with white rice, like soy sauce. Yeah, that's true. And I can't remember having this type of chicken with kind of a sauce on it, in on the Spanish the Spanish rice. rice. Yeah. yeah. So let's see. Let's check it out. Mm. Good? Yes, but. Uh oh. No buts, no, no buts. No. I could probably put a little more mole because the flavoring, from what I remember, it's like triggering sensors. Oh, dang. Was stronger. It's a little, got a little bit of a kick to it. But very good, delicious. I'm so you would say you would you would say you would add more sauce. Just a little bit more of the mole for the okay. flavoring. Okay. But otherwise, delicious. Oh yeah. Oh man. This totally brings back memories. Oh my god. That's gosh. so cool. I love that. that like, I re I have complete memories right now of my kitchen growing up, like sitting there. Eating. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. All right, you guys. Let's see how Ethan. Oh, um, this looks really yeah, but let's see what he thinks because the taste it might be different. Taste? Might take a couple bites to like it. Let's see. That's delicious. Oh. You like it? Is it spicy at all? Just a little. It's so good. Yeah? You like that? So good. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, he's going in for more. You know it's good. <laughs> it's good, boy. Here, I want you to try so, what do you think? All right, now it's mom's turn. Ash, are you going to try it? No? Okay. Okay. Mom's turn. This is dinner, guys. Let's Baby. see. Oh man. I'm curious what Elijah, because Elijah might like it actually. I'm so hungry. Mm. I like it. Is that different for you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I like it. Oh, yeah, wow. like I, as I eat more of it, it like, you're like, oh, this is good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you get what I'm saying, kind of with the texture of the chicken? Mm -hmm. It's so good. The texture doesn't bother me. That's like the barbecue chicken I made. Yeah, no, I'm, it doesn't bother me. I'm the just saying like how I would chew it up. Like the flavor, how would you describe It's good. It's different. It's not an overwhelming, powerful flavor. But like but I said, my mom did it. It was a little bit stronger. Just a little bit. It's so good. We did add salt, and I feel like that helps a little bit. But if I added just a little bit oh, more. I like it. Yeah. No, I like it. It's good. This is really good, babe. Mmm. I want to see what Elijah thinks. All right, here's Elijah. Elijah, this is called chicken mole. This smells good. Let's see, dude. Mm. Different? I like it a lot. Really? Wow. It's like, it has, it's like a little spicy taste. It's like, like a lot of flavor. I haven't tried the rice with that yet. No, oh, we want. We're gonna have some for dinner. Is that all right? That's definitely all right. Yeah. Wow, I'm impressed. <laughs> nice. Right? I knew you might like it because you you like the Cafe Rio sweet pork, mm -hmm. and it reminds me of a different flavor, but the texture of it's the same as the sweet pork. Mm -hmm. Same, same texture. Tastes different. Right. 
but still good. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Nice. Do you want to try it, MZ? Yeah. Uh, oh. It's like something that should be in cafe. Right? That's right, boy. Good. I knew I knew you would like it. That's why I wanted you to cut over here. That's good. Yeah. All right. Here's sweet little MZ Poo. Aww, MZ Poo Poo. Aww. So we need more of this. Let's go. Not, not Ooh. Rice. There, a little bit of rice. Taste it. And let's see how what she thinks. Emberlyn's honest, so if she doesn't really like it too much, she'll say it. If she really likes it, she's like, mmm, delicious. It's all right, because a little, it kind of burns my tongue. A little spicy? Oh, it does have a little It has a little kick to it. So, it's all right. But I am fine with that. Yeah, like if you would eat it, like if you had a glass of water or something like, or something with to drink with it. Yeah, I would eat it. Awesome, because guess what's for dinner tonight? Hmm. Chicken mole. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys. So there you go. There is, there is our chicken mole cook with me. As we mentioned yesterday, we are going to start doing a lot of our regular videos, the grocery hauls the um, cook with me's, kids in the kitchens. We're gonna do them and try our best to incorporate them with our family vlogs. Honestly, because we just want the memories. Like the memories of, of, our, of our day to day, and especially now that it's summer, we just kind of have a lot going on, lots to vlog. And so we don't wanna just try to like, you know what I'm saying? Like just fit in what we can. We want to be able to get what we're doing all summer long, but also still give you guys like the food stuff as well because we know we have a lot of foodies out there that love the food stuff. So we're gonna just try to give it all to you guys as much as we can. So if you see a title and it's food, most likely, most likely it will also be a vlog. Let's head over to How Inez Rolls. We got the third period of the game still going. Or yes. Actually, it hasn't started, started yet, yet. So we're gonna try to make it over there before the third period. Go hang out. I have a feeling they might get sick of us by the end of the summer. Well, no, because they invited us over. That's true. That's so. true. It's their own fault. Sorry, yeah. guys. <laughs> All right, you guys. We're gonna head over to Paul and Inez. Oh, Elijah, we're gonna eat over there. So go put that away. I don't want. You're not supposed to eat in here, bud. Oh, okay. Because we don't oh, want a mess in here. It's and this computer is in here just temporarily because of vacation. So. So. It says, photo puzzles, hashtag 24 Spongebob, spot the difference is difference brain games, games for kids. And then you have to look for the differences. Oh, child friendly. Oh, you're looking at the differences. Oh, I get it. I'll see right there, the yellow and the yellow. Yeah. The white. It okay. You, it gives you a time, so see that red thing? It oh. It goes like up to here, and then it goes back. Well, that's fun. So who did their 20 minutes of reading today? Good. Chapter 20, Benny 22, and Yes, you guys. Where is your book? Oh my you God. guys, seriously, Benny chewed one of the library books we got which yesterday. Which means what? Seriously, which means we've got to pay for it. Which means also what? This Ethan. little guy didn't put it away. Okay. Oh, Ethan oh. left it. <laughs> Wait a minute. They said we should have done the simulator when Paul and Inez was there because they would be rolling. Oh, <laughs> get it? <laughs> that was funny. Yeah, yeah. Here we go, Fortnite dances, Fortnite dances. Oh, 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 take the L. Okay, let's go. Oh, you almost kicked Ashton in the face. Do your, fl do your floss, MZ. Go, Ezra, do your flossing. Oh yeah. <laughs> Don't hurt yourself. Ethan lost his tooth. Let's see, dude. And it wasn't at school for once. How many of your teeth have you lost at school? I lost 13, so I, maybe I 
At least half of your teeth you've lost at school. Ten of the thirteen at school? Nine or ten. Wow. Was that one pushed out? I pulled it. Nice. Whenever I'd wiggle, it would make like a creaking sound. Oh, and then you just pulled it or it just fell? Well, I pulled it and it was like literally like flipped like upside down. Like, I So like here's the tooth and it was like that. And like I tried to pull it off, but it would like scrape my gum. Ugh. So then I, I went, I, I cut out from out like inward to, towards my mouth. So I, I, I moved my tongue going like this. Did you pull it the other way to get so it out? I pulled it the other way. Oh, pop. Nice. All right, you guys. So we're back from Inez's house. And now it's time for bed. We've had, let's see. It's 11.30, so we've had two super late nights in a row, huh? Oh, yeah. Are we going to go to sleep to a movie, though? Can yeah. I tell them how late I stayed up? How late? 2 o'clock in the morning yesterday because you guys filmed a video so late. That's right. And I, want, I kind of want to hear their reactions. What movie are we going to watch, Elias? You tired? Like you guys are going to knock out in the first five Wonder minutes. Woman. All right, we Wonder thinking, Woman. We were thinking about Spider-Man Homecoming, but we're watching that tomorrow. Like, you know, I was thinking you should, you should say Wonder, so either you say we, and then you say R, and I say going, you say to watch Wonder Woman. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ready, set, go. We are watching Wonder Woman. Yeah. Oh. Alright, let's go up. Let's get ready for bed. We didn't run! It's supposed to be, we are going to watch! We are going to watch Wonder Woman. Okay, yeah. Wonder Woman. Alright, let's go get pajamas on and teeth brushed. I want to see who can be done oh, yeah. first. Yeah, that was nice. You guys did Ethan's chores for him, huh? Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's some good siblings there. We're gonna mark that off as a uh, good sibling bonus. We have to do the thing where you put the stuff in the jar like the ticket thingy. Oh yeah, maybe we could do that. We um, could do something. All right, Bems, brushing your teeth. Yeah. Where's your toothbrush? All your toothbrushes are missing. Oh. Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's go. All right, Ethan's already knocked out. The movie hasn't even begun. Oh, you tricked me. I thought you were sleeping. I think the swimming wore you out though, huh? Ow, it just yeah. cracked my neck. Oh, ouch. I was so tired over at the house. Did you brush your teeth? Yeah, I knew my toothbrush. Go get it. Did you brush your teeth? Waiting for Go get it. I wanted Did you brush your teeth? Go get it. Did you brush your teeth? Yeah. Are you still awake? No. You know. <laughs> All right, everybody. So. We, Whoa, I look so red right now. We've been getting so many requests in the in the comments from yesterday's vlog with the pain simulator and everyone's oh my like gosh. and everyone's like, "Oh, Tina, let Tina do it. Let oh Tina like gosh. test it out to see if it really works." If Yeah, cuz you know, Tina hasn't already had 5 babies yeah. or experienced this 5 times already. <laughs> so the the whole purpose of it is for Tina to try this out and to basically say, oh my gosh, I remember what it's like having a baby. I really get that feeling that I want another one. And so, uh, yes. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> nice try though. <laughs> but anyway, so everyone wants Tina to try it. And so we are totally, I am totally down for that, you guys. Of course he is. So totally down. So yes. what, what we're going to do is we're going to come up with a challenge, you guys. Yes. A challenge where two of these pads are going to be hooked up to me the other two are going to be hooked up to tina then we're going to play a game and we're going to do a challenge and the challenge that we're going to be doing is 